on business lunch and let's focus on the mutual fund data for the month of may which saw the highest ever monthly equity inflows at 34000 crore rupees fueled by a massive surge of money in nfos and thematic funds surbi is joining here to tell us more surbi it's a record number what more do you have for us it is a record number it's big and it's green and in fact the net equity inflow number is the highest that we've seen for any month gone by hold your breath 34670 crores that's the amount of money that retail investors have pumped into mutual funds and that tells us that they have literally dug their heels in and kept buying every single dip remember all the volatility just before the elections in may when the market was going into a range we had about a 1000 point dip on the index well guess what retail investors went in and bought it not just that the sip number that's also rock steady for the month gone by in fact, it's, it's inching towards the 21,000 uh, mark, 21,000 uh, or 21,000 crore rupees on a monthly basis, coming in just shy of that at 20,904 crores. The other major trend that really stands out this time around is this huge surge in thematic funds. Thematics as a category have been growing because remember, mutual funds can only launch one fund per category. So there's one large cap fund for every fund house, one mid cap fund, so on and so forth. But if it's thematics, you can launch as many products as you want and therefore there's a lot of innovation going on on this side. So the, the NFO mop-up is 10,140 crores and that's a huge number, the biggest number that we've seen since February. The reason is HDFC uh, uh, coming out with their manufacturing fund. That fund alone mopped up around 9,500 crores. So that explains this huge NFO number. And because it was a manufacturing fund, the overall thematic number is also a gigantic 19,213 crores. Contrast this to the about 5,200 crores that came in in the month of uh, April. And it kind of gives you a sense of the scale, how thematics are really uh, growing. Small dip in the hybrid category. The number has come down to about 17,991, just under 18,000 crores. But nothing to worry, it's still very, very steady and very healthy. There's still a lot of money coming in multi-asset funds, which the industry is pushing because they, you know, give you uh, uh, allocation across different asset classes, similarly balanced advantage funds. So it also tells you that uh, retail investors are, you know, not throwing asset allocation out of the window. And some of these hybrid funds are also getting in plenty of money. So overall, a very healthy report card for the month of May. Steady, healthy, green, breathtaking, plenty of adjectives there to describe the Amphi number. Survi, thanks a lot for that update. Now, Sebi has